I look a hot mess. <laughs> so listen, you guys know that I've been working on the office. I got a bunch of stuff that has to be donated. My mom came up to pick up the stuff so that uh, Hope House can pick it up from her house on Friday and a, star, a car pulls up. It passes by and backs up and then it turns into my yard. You guys, Miss H, one of our family members recognized me as tore up as I look and stopped to say hello. Say hey, Miss H. Say hey, Miss Hi. H. <laughs> So I, I just meet her. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm super excited. It's the first time somebody's recognized me like that. And so I'm super excited and I just wanted to share the moment with you guys. It's beautiful. So what are you out here doing today? We are out here looking for land, my husband and son and I. We're looking around Locust Grove. We've been looking to move to Locust Grove now for probably eight months. Mm -hmm. We've been here in Stockbridge since 2018. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And so we've been looking around, and one one lot has been sold. That okay. We wanted to check by Tanger Outlet. Uh huh. That's there not was, far from here. Yeah, two uh, lands. Okay. Together, and they were going to sell them for fifteen five. Okay. You know, but they're sold. Right. So those are gone. What was the name just, of that street? Um, it's on the side of Tanger. I don't, let me have that, that's fine. It's one in our. Uh, it's a mobile home community in Hampton, not okay. far from here. Okay. We were looking at a property there, and I think they wanted fifteen mm. five for that too. But what got mm -hmm. you interested in mobile home? Mobile home diva. <laughs> mobile home diva. One day, um, one of her videos was in the recommended. It was uh, the one where your home was being put together. Mm -hmm. And you said, it's here. <laughs> My home is here today, you guys. I'm so excited. And then you see the trucks bringing them in and everything. Yeah. And then you see clips of, I guess, where they had uh, did the concrete, you know, and everything. And... I was so excited and I've been amped ever since and now I've got my husband on board. Good. And so we've been looking. My husband wasn't on board until I got yeah. us approved. Yeah. yeah. This one is is yeah. Yeah, because he too. didn't think that this was the same as a home and he feels the same. Yeah, way. but this and I mean he's driving around and I said, I think some people just lost touch with because I was raised to take pride in home ownership. Yeah. Period. No so, matter what home you have. So most of these homes, we're the newest home in this community. Yeah. These homes in this community have been out here 20, 30 years. That's right. She was raised in this house and she's oh, in her really? 70s. Yep. She was raised oh, in this wow. in her house and oh. she's in her 70s. Uh -huh. And her son, who lives in the yellow house, uh -huh. um, builds. He's a carpenter. Uh -huh. And so... If you ride through all the streets, you'll see another house that looks like his. That's uh -huh. his sister. Oh so they all grew up in this house. Oh and then God. as he became a carpenter, he uh -huh. started making his house uh -huh. look like this one. <gasps> Experience ever. Like, somebody actually recognized me, you guys. I was super excited. It felt like, I felt like, I don't know. Listen, that was the best experience ever. I'm trying to capture my feelings so I can share them with you. And I mean, here's the thing. It, for a slight second, it felt a little creepy that somebody knew where I live. But then when she said, I'm Mrs. H, I'm like, I feel like Mrs. H is my sister. I do because She's very encouraging in her comments. She has watched every single video on my channel. I know I have over 300 videos. Miss H has probably commented on every single Mobile Home Diva and See Me Vlogs video. She's even gone back to years ago um, when I wasn't even serious about YouTube. Like my cruise videos or my workout videos like these from like three or four years ago and she's i've seen comments from her on those and she's not the only person that's watched all of my videos i'm 
she's emailed me she watches my videos she's very encouraging she asks questions she follows up like so when i met her today i instantly felt at ease when i saw that it was her she was actually in the neighborhood looking for lots and i was able to give her a little history about um the area um encourage her to contact my realtor um just talk to her and like i felt like she was my sister so i didn't get her husband and her son on video but i also wanted to give a shout out not only to miss h but her husband mark was the one that actually recognized me they passed by and he told her that's the mobile home diva right there and she was like no and he was like yeah so i mean wow you guys that made me feel good so to mark christopher and kimberly it was so nice to meet you today i'm super excited for your journey i can't wait to see the land that you pick i can't wait to see the home i know you want the lula May. i hope you get it it doesn't always work out like that but i really hope you get it i can't wait to see your home on your property anything you need uh me to answer for you that i can i will and thank you so much for stopping and letting me know that you recognize me it made me feel really really good about what i'm doing you guys i do this to help other people because i depended on youtube i listen if i don't know how to use a can opener i can you can bet your bottom dollar that when i go to youtube there's 2500 videos on how to open a can opener if i don't know how to paint a dresser if i don't know how to unscrew a new device there's always informational videos that teach you how to do that but when i was starting the journey of looking for a mobile home there was no one who had been through the journey that could take help me to understand what their process was like. I recognize that every process is different, but I'd like to see an overall view of what the process looks like, and I couldn't find that on YouTube. Now, since I've been on YouTube, I have seen a lot of tour channels but I don't see a lot of channels with people who also um, explain the process. And I love posting tours and I'm gonna start doing that again real soon. Oh, just to let you know, I haven't been doing it because I ran out of video and I've been trying to make a trip. It seems like every time I'm off, it's either raining, like it's raining right now, or I'm just super tired and I just haven't, because my next place to go is Augusta and they because they have five mobile home lots and I need to be rested and have energy to do that. So hopefully next Monday, it won't be raining because I was definitely gonna go this week but it was supposed to rain and it didn't. Hopefully next Monday it's clear and I can go. If it is, you'll start seeing tours again real soon. But I'm also working on sharing with you the journey part of it. The next video that I'm gonna share about the journey will be, I haven't decided if it's gonna be the closing or if I'm gonna talk about the process a little more when you go to the mobile home. Cause I didn't really touch on our experience walking through the homes, talking to the sales people and also I have some video of the day we picked out our home. So I think that's gonna be the next one and then after that is gonna be closing. I probably won't record those videos until um, next week, but they are coming. I just wanted to share my experience today and let you know that, especially let um, Kim, Mark, and Christopher know that meeting them today really solidified why I do this, right? I do this because I want somebody else to to get encouraged, motivated, and educated by 
what I share about my experience. I am not a professional. There's a lot of questions that I cannot answer, but I can share my experience with you and let you know what we've been through. So that's what I try to do. And you guys showed me today that it's worth it because look at you. You're even looking in the area that I live in. And because of the videos that I shared, Kim helped to share her desire with her husband. And now they're all looking for a home. So I'm super, super excited. Um, and I can't see, wait to see where your journey goes. So anyway, that's the end of this video. I know it's short. Well, it may not be because I got like five minutes of talking with Kim, but um, I just wanted to make this a video on its own. I wanted to share my experience with you guys today. I'm super excited about it. So thanks for letting me share and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye-bye.